with this, our beloved brethren, guests, and invitees, we launch into the time when we listen to the testimonies of the great and mighty things God has been doing, we do, and we continue to do in the life of our brethren. We urge you now to receive the testimonies of the Lord by clapping unto the God of chosen. Clap unto him wherever you are. Join in clapping to God. Appreciate him. Magnify the name of the Lord with your clapping. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of the chosen. Thank you, Lord, for our testifiers today. We plead with you. Go straight to the point. Give us your name, your address. The first time you came to chosen. And then the miracle of what God has done for you. The first testifier. Hallelujah. Choose in praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Sister Sarah Richard. I'm from Ninja State, New Busa. I joined Choosing 2018. This, year, this year? Yes, sir. Hmm. Thank you, Father. Last month, March. Thank you, Lord. My testimony goes like this. I always watch our Daddy Joe on cable. And I love the preaching so much. But I was not a choosing. And I was into jewelries. Wearing earrings, necklaces, tights, trousers, and all manner of dressing that are not decent. So by the time I started hearing the preaching from our daddy Jill, I was angry that why is he preaching about all these things? But as time goes on, I pick interest in the, in the preaching. <laughs> so the church that was attending, they don't preach about it. And any time I remove my earrings and I go to my former church, they will ask me that, you did not wear earrings today, what happened? I will not be able to say anything. So by the time I started watching this choosing cable, my ears started paining me. It was paining me that, my ear started swollen up. Hmm. So, I decided to have that earring that day. Our daddy Joe said, if you know you are into earrings, that that earring is from the marine kingdom. That is not from God. That you should stop it and you'll be free. So, I decided to have that earring that day. That my ear was paining me. So, when I slept in the night, I have a dream. I saw a man. He was very huge, although I can't see his face. In that dream, I was dressing, I, I was just dressing to go out, so I was trying to put, put on my earrings so that I would go out. That was how this man just came and said, give me your earrings. I said, I will not give you my earrings. He said, give me your earrings. I said, I will not give you my earrings. He said, do you know that you are, you are in a bondage? Hmm. I said, ah, what kind of bondage? And normally, I, I used to get angry. Unnecessary thing will just make me to get angry. Hatred. I will quarrel. I will fight people for no reason. So I wanted to stop it, but I can't. I can't. So in that dream, he said I should give him my earrings. That if I should give him my earrings, that I will be free from this bondage. That is how I just gave him my earrings. So I wake up on that dream. When I woke up, I just feel that something has left me. Hmm. I feel free. Power. Thank you, God of Chosen. All the things that used to make me to get angry before, they are just like, I don't see them like something that will make me get angry again. Hmm. Even fighting and quarreling, hmm. I can't even fight again because I don't have that strength to fight. So I want to appreciate the name of the Lord who have done this for me. I am very happy to be a choosing. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. I'm very happy to be in the midst of my brothers and sisters today. So, I pray for our daddy Gio, heaven at last. All the choosing members, all the choosing pastors, me and my family, heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. Wonderful testimony. These are chosen people and God is bringing them in by every means. We believe that today, as you hear that word that she been listening to on cable, God will also confirm you a choosing in Jesus' name. 
the next testifier. Jesus, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus, people, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Brethren, I'm happy to stand here today. Jesus, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Sister Freedom Angela. I joined Choosing in the year 2011. I'm coming from Sango Branch, Kwara State. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Brethren, I want to thank this God of Choosing who remembered a sinner like me. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And made me among the death fire in the Lord choosing. Choose the praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Brethren, I'm so happy. Hallelujah. Amen. It happened that when I joined this ministry, in fact, I had that here with sorrow. Hallelujah. Amen. But today, God of choosing have wiped away my tears. Choose the praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Brethren, it happened that I entered this choosing with hotness of the body, frequent urination. Hallelujah. Amen. So, this choosing proved to me that he is a mighter than all. It seemed like a dream. Hallelujah. Amen. So, I want to thank this God because he has done it for me by running away seven years and some months frequent urinating. Power! Choose him, praise the Lord! Hallelujah! He did not stop there. He said, how can I leave hotness of the body to be troubling you? This hotness of the body that I'm telling you of, if you come near me, you see how my face look like. You may think maybe I'm bleaching or maybe another thing happened to me. Mm. But when this thing come, the thing will hold me or my body will burn. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And this God of choosing crushed them away. Power. Choosing people praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to return all glory to him. Thank you. I want to return all honor to him. I promise it me if I will stand on this pulpit to give a testimony in Lord Jesus. That I will need and glorify his name. I want to glorify the God of Jesus who have made it possible for me to be among the testifiers in the Lord Jesus. Thank you, my Father, because you are a faithful God for remembering a sinner like me. I return all glory, all honor, all adoration to this faithful God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Brethren, at this junction, I pray for my Jew, heaven at last. Amen. I pray for the chosen ones all over the world. I and my family, heaven at last. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Choosing is the first class. Yes, so. I love my geo. I love my brethren. I love my church. Choosing people praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Are you an indigenous of this quarter state? No, sir. Okay, but you live in quarter state, Sango yes, Branch. Sir. Yes, sir. Clap on to God and appreciate him now. Thank you, Father. The next testifier. Jesus, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is My name is Sister Bossa Jimo. Before I'm Muslim, I'm Kwara State. You are from Kwara State? Yes. You are an indigenous of Kwara State? Yes. Okay. I, I joined Jesus in 2017, last year. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Jesus. Before I join choosing, I mean, serious sickness that is out many names. Fifteen years sickness. But last day when I joined choosing, my geo mentioned my case, and the case, and my geo mentioned my case, and the case is go. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. After my geo mentioned my case, the second day. I see 
seen in the dream the evil person that I, I mean in the dream when one well the one family from from when I'm no they are come for a dream that they are from that they are small to come that that they do for forgiveness so that I should forgive them for the dream I say ah, which people that call me call my name and my family outside when I mean I will enter the motor to see the evil man is the person when I know more than 16 years 15 years after that for the dream when I wake up the second day the man when I see for the dream is calling my phone ah, the fear I can no I don't know how I'll carry the call hmm. going to three days he sent his best friend to my house that he should come and beg me I should forgive him. Hey. I say, ah. Thank you, Father. Forgive. What he's doing, and what he said that he's doing for me. He said, he, he did not mention, but he come for forgiveness. If I forgive him, anything I leave, I, um, I need for this life, he will do it for me. I say, no. Because I am a chosen now. Hmm. If, he want to, if he want me to forgive me, tell him to come for my house. And I will carry him to choosing to forgive me. He said that he cannot take his two eyes to see me that I'm turned to big lion. He's, he's fearing me. Hey! Hey! Power! Thank you, Lord. For this age, I thank God of my pastor that he gave me 15 years sickness fast. Hmm. No small sickness. Hmm. Money. Everything has going for the sickness. But today, I thank God of my pastor. Hmm. I pray for my. This sickness people. lasted for 15 years. 15 years. What kind of what what type of sickness? And the man mentioned that he, oh, he don't know what God and worship because he's many, he's, he has many people that have his king, but only me they are alive. I saw many people saying he can mention ten people when he's trying to mention the people when he uh, mention his mommy's name. I fear and I wake up from the dream. Say, hey, God of choosing fat, you be baba. Hmm. For many so, people. Uh, how was that sickness? What, what type of sickness was this? For 15 years? The sickness, when, before I know, when the sickness start, started, I thought it's small sickness. When they carry me to go to hospital, the first hospital said that it's malaria and thyroid. They treat it, treat it, but the sickness is not good. I go many hospitals that all the hospitals give me the results. But for me, I know that it's one, it's like snake from this stomach hmm. moving up and down for 15 years. Hmm. When my GO we mentioned the case, my GO said that there is one lady here that is carrying snake many years hmm. for stomach and he spray for the snake since last year. I didn't the snake ran away from your body. Fact. Can we clap unto the God of chosen? The God of the pastor of chosen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. When when the man is convinced, he said that he's killed many people, like ten, he can mention ten people. But for me, it's only me, it's my life. Hmm. Hmm. I thank God of my pastor. Thank you, Father. God of my Geo, thank you, God Lord. of choosing. Thank you, Father. I pray for my Geo and his wife, his children, even at last in Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus, Pastor, like the word, even at last in Jesus' name. Amen. Choosing member, all like the word, even at last in Jesus' name. Amen. And my family, even at last in Jesus' name. Amen. I love my pastor. I love my church. I love all my chosen members. All that. Let us clap on the God of the chosen and rejoice because we are now totally different. He said the evil man said he cannot behold her face. He could not come and make confession directly. Why? He said her face is not looking like a lion. I want to tell you that after today all the evil people your face will be like terror unto them in Jesus' name. I'd like to inform everyone that we have language classes towards the right hand side of the pulpit. If you
you want to listen to the testimonies, to the ministrations today in Yoruba language, for example, and the Hausa language, go towards my right hand side. We have language classes there. And if you are an interpreter, if you are an interpreter of Lord's choosing, Hausa language, Yoruba language, also go there immediately. You have something to do. God bless you as you obey the next testifier. Choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Choosing praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. By the special grace of God, my name is Brother Wangkwo Ai Chinedu. I joined the Lost Choosing the Year 2009. I want to thank this God for making me a choosing. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God of Chosen. First and foremost, I want to thank this good God who brought I and my fellow colleagues, even the campus branch, Bida, Federal Polytechnic, Bida, Ninja State. I want to thank this God for bringing us down here safely, even to to witness such a crusade like this. I say this good God, let his name alone be praised now and forevermore in Jesus' name. Amen. I also want to thank this God who has been using the lost using students down there at Bida, Bida um, Poly Branch. I want to thank this God who has been using us aimlessly to cause revival even in the Polytechnic. Hmm. I say let this good God who has started this, let his name alone be praised now and forevermore in Jesus' name. Amen. I also want to thank this God who has been favoring the choosing ones, the, the, the students at the campus there, God of choosing has been blessing us in our resort. Now you can't see a student, uh, a choosing student having carry over or even come out with a bad result. You see us coming out with distinctions and upper credit. Uh, Clap on to God. God who has been doing hey. choosing praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I also want to thank God on behalf of our pastor and on behalf of our Petro, whom God has been using to bless the students both physically and spiritually. I want to say, let this good God, and whatsoever be their heart, heart desires, let this good God grant it unto them in Jesus' name. Amen. At this question, I pray for my general pastor, all the choosing pastors, members, the campus fellowship, heaven at last in Jesus' name. Amen. So you have a team. I'm asking you. Yes, sir. You have a team of campus fellowship members. Yes, sir. From Bida Polytechnic yes, sir. in Niger State. State. Yes, sir. That came for this crusade. Yes, sir. Oh, let's clap unto God and appreciate Him. Clap unto the God of the Chosen. It's a good opportunity to advise you. Join Chosen Campus Fellowship everywhere, whether in Bida or in Quara State, anywhere, any tertiary institution. Join Chosen Campus Fellowship. Advise your children, your world to join them so that they will be protected by the power of the Most High God. They will also excel like our brother has advertised that all of them are graduating in distinction and in high grades. Make your children to join Choosing Campus Fellowship. I'd be very, very glad that they did in Jesus' name. The next testifier. Chosen praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Sister Zainab. Formerly before I joined the Choosing now, I thank God that I'm a product of this glory in the gym, Yoruba. Thank Lord you, Father. Brethren. Thank you, God of Jesus. I thank God also for making this my Ilori township of Kwara State to be the very first one among all the 19 Northern states that, that our brethren that God used very mightily and greatly in all these 19 states in this year 2018. I thank God for bringing this crusade to this my very critical Islamic township. I thank this God of choosing in the mighty name of Jesus. Christ. Amen. I also thank God for making me a choosing. Thank you, Lord. My first testimony goes like this. In Jesus' mighty name. I was, I was unable to come to this he learned for very for good 14 years. Hmm. And for that spirit of bondage and spirit of spiritual prison. I've been thinking of how to come to this this learning since there was no in fact every every way was so blocked. Maybe this Lord Chusing Church, God of Chusing, make this 
that you teach her to be born because of me. Mm. Because enemy doesn't know that I will cross to to change to be a Christian at all. Mm. Maybe if they've known that I may even change to be a Christian, they might have thought of how to block that way also. When I started to be going to church, a friend of mine, my schoolmate, invited me to Mountain of Fire. And I've also been to Celestia Church. I've been also to Teru and Seravu. I, I was born and brought up in Lagos, but I'm indigenous of this Ilori Quara State. So since I've been going to all these different, different, three different church, not, nothing, nothing happened. Hmm. But when I joined this juicing in the year 2011, in, by his special grace, in the year 2012, God of Juicing crossed me over to this, my township. Hmm. I thank this God of Juicing for breaking that the iron. to God of Juicing, the iron breaker. Juicing, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My another testimony goes like this. I, we, I have an enemy as old that is an occult man, very strong man in my family who has been afflicting all my family. Some will run mad, some will just experience premature death. He has been doing all this. And when God of Jesus took over, I heard now that the particular man, by his merciful grace, God of Jesus has fought my family battle and he has returned back to sender all this affliction as he has been troubling us, afflicting us. Now, the, the man has been afflicted with stroke hmm. and paralysis. God of Jesus, clap on to God. The only choice he has is to repent. Another testimony is a revelation that made me to confirm and to be very, very convinced indeed that this Lord Jesus Church is the very righteous kingdom where they are preaching this un undiluted word of preaching that many churches are not preaching. That even make me to know that this is the last first stop hmm. that are supposed to be. Father. That dream goes like this. I was in a dream where I was in a very wide space like this. That place, we were running, there was shops and some buildings by the right hand side and by the left hand side. And we were very plenty. Rain wanted to fall. As that rain started showering, all of us were running air and scatter. We, we were looking for where to hide our head before that rain will be a very heavy rain. So that we continue where we are going after the rain. So it got to a stage just suddenly like this. As we were running, I saw myself alone and alone. Just exactly as that baby's church. That any seashore that there will be only all this white white sand. So all that place, as very big as that place, I saw that white shore. At the, the end of that white shore, it was as if the, the sand was that touching the the sky like this. No even common paper. No any, anything at all. Only myself alone and alone. No any woman being. I stood over there. I started wondering. I look at left and right. I look at front and back. I said, where I was wondering. I said, where are all those people that we were all running? So that this rain will not be taught. I, as I was still wondering that much. I did not close my eye. Oh. I was still wondering. Looking left everywhere. I saw another very strange light. That kind of light in my life since I was brought to this life. I have never seen that kind of life, light in my life. It was just like a fluorescent. Hmm. I cannot see the end of it. Either they dig it under the ground or they just place it on, on the ground. And even the end of it, or, or, I, well, either they dig it inside the sky or it's just touching the sky. I, I couldn't see the, the beginning and the end of it. Hmm. It was hmm. so bright, so whitish. But like fluorescent. I said fluorescent light is not as tall as this. That I couldn't even see the end of it like this. I was wondering. I was wondering. And this light, as I was standing alone at this particular place, it was as if somebody entered sugarcane farm like this. Even if I want to move forward like this, I will have to bend like this before I will pass. All this light just surrounded me. As very big as that place. All this light come and flash so very blackly. 
I said, God of choosing. I come and forget about thinking of all those ones that we were running for the rain. I come and be thinking of it. Who planted this thing? Who brought it? At least I was the only one thinking of where others that we were running for the rain were. Who brought it? At least I did not open my eye. I started wondering about that again. This is how I opened my eye. So I was so baff, I didn't know who to tell. It, it got to a faithful day. We have service in my third year show, Lord Choosing Church, through the region 3. Because I'm an evangelist, I followed the evangelist since Saturday to this my town. So when I told Pastor Stephen, he was my 2011 president pastor, then, Elder Pastor Stephen, I said, This is what I saw. I narrated my, my revelation to him. He said, That is Jesus. I was surprised. I said, Jesus, remember I said, I'm from this, this Ilorin, and my father and my mother have family lineage. We are typical Muslim. Even my forefather generation, both my father and mother family lineage. So I told Pastor Stephen, I said, but Jesus, I believe that if I will see Jesus, I will see him in human form. So that when, we, when I was still schooling, all these Bible story book, when we open it, when we were reading something like Christian, that's why I don't like Christian. We don't like touching Bible at all. Before God, I just to do this one that's in my life. I said, I will see that man. They will draw that man in form of human form. He will carry sheep behind his neck like this. Or I will see him. They will draw him. He will carry his children on his hand like this. So I told Pastor Steve, I said, and my Yoruba people usually sing one song. They will say, Jesus fell on Monday. So that is what I thought I will see if it is Jesus. He said, beneficiaries of the great move of power of God in this ministry. 